We got an original service manual for the Jag. We got an original service manual. Bunch of a bunch of boys at the club would like that. Oh yeah. Original for Briggs. Oh. And, oh, you'll like this one. Original Mercury service manual. Right there. Oh, hello, hello. Original, 1966 to 1974. That's upwards only though, isn't it? Well, yeah, that's all we need. Yeah, true. Because you, you don't buy such awesome sleds as twisters. No, you buy just a good ass motor. No, you buy like brand new skidoos that get smoked by twisters. No. Yeah. Yeah, well, it's because you can't buy Mercs anymore, so. Yeah, you can. You can't? Not They're just restored in. I just want a new one. I want a new sled. Why? Why? Because you're weird. What? That's why you're crew chief of Cracks Racing. Why? Because <laughs> you want a new sled and you can't have, handle the vintage. Oh, I can't handle the vintage. I have a vintage. Yeah, but it's actually no, it's a classic. Or it's on the it's on the breaking line because it's an '89. Yeah. I forget the exact uh, dates, but I'm into the vintage tractors though. So. Antique is back in like '50s and '60s. Vintage is '70s and some weird '80s, I think, and classic beyond that. Or something like that. I don't know. I forget. Oh, we got some other, uh... we got this badass helmet here for like a hundred bucks. From Rosso Row Enterprises, I think that's how you pronounce it. At the snow, Toronto Snowmobile Show in October. They race up in uh, Innisfil. I think Honda Senior and... I forget the exact class, but it's uh, two-stroke anyways. I'm not sure if he's going to be running the same classes or not, but go check them out. Give him a good deal. I got these at uh, Royal Distributing, FXR. They're going well with my color scheme, as you can see here. They're not even the same company, but... And they got a bunch of uh, snow pants to go along with that too. You got nice new gear for this year. And then we got Team Arctic Cat. What do you call this thing here? Whatever. It's pretty cool. It goes with the monster jersey. Snow Pro on the back. Or the head there. And we got our chips and beer. That's all you need. Country and metal and chips. Beer and sleds. And tractors and... Wood, everything. Everything you can ever dream for. Oh yeah, chug that beer. Chug it like you own it. How does that taste compared to a nice Pabst Blue Ribbon? Nothing's like a Pabst. Oh, uh, of course not. Nope. Can't recreate the Pabst taste. No. <laughs> Nature's choices. If that's even a word. Products. Yeah, uh, no, it's not even choices. It's choicest, because it's the I is like before the C, and just E S T at the end. But yeah, Look, I don't even we're looking into linguistics label. here now. What's that? I doesn't even have a top label. Well, why bother spending the money on it? extra advertising? You already know what you bought. They might as well put it back into making it taste better. Like, of course, because Paps tastes so freaking damn good. Well, so this one doesn't have a top label either.